ask you a question. Okay. What, what kind of endings do you prefer? Depends on the story. What happens in yours? In my story, a man sets off on a long voyage and overcomes one obstacle after another. And on the last page, he has to decide to continue his life in exile or to come back home to what was once his home. Dad, do you want to tell me something? We all have regrets. Everything is broken. Why does everyone continue to refer to Dad as if he's not here? What is he? Dad. Dad! I just don't know what you're saying. I'm gonna have to make some hard choices. You keep reminding me of someone that I once knew. Where have you been all day, Dad? Wake up, Liam. <laughs> However far away you go, you are always you. Your father had a heart attack in the bathtub and he drowned. I didn't even know he took baths. She ruined the place. I was just looking for the restroom. But hasn't moved since you lived here. He hasn't paid the mortgage in six months. It'll all go up for auction. The furniture, the house, everything. You have friends? Not since I became a homewrecker. Do you need a place to stay? This is the worst thing you could have actually done. Roommates with my dad's mistress. I'm married to your father. I'm not his mistress. Yeah. Well, not anymore. Where's your mom? She's basically just staring at the wall of our camper. I'm a broke widow without a single marketable skill. I live with my husband's ex-wife and, oh, special hobbies. Drinking with his teenage dropout daughter. I read your paper. It contains some exceptional science. My instinct is that there is another element. You think you found an undiscovered element? <laughs> Science is changing, and the very people who are running science believe the world was flat. Leave my laboratory. If my science doesn't speak for itself, then you have gravely misunderstood it. I'm going to prove them wrong. We all thought that atoms were finite and stable. Well, some of them are not. I have called this radioactivity. Our discovery could cure cancer. Extraordinary. You changed the world. Our work's been nominated for the Nobel Prize. The commendation only mentions my name. You stole my brilliance. How dare you take their applause? This is bigger than both of us. I just wanted to do good science. There are those that say that radium is making them sick. The question can be raised whether mankind benefits from knowing the secrets of nature. I have been haunted my entire life trying to understand the impossible. This is my fight, and I will win it. Good morning, sunshine. Oh, no. I got you. This is probably cold now, though. Oh, thanks, Charlie. Surprise! Oh, my gosh, you guys. Would you mind grabbing the cake from the kitchen? Hammer, I am so sorry. You working on winning Kevin back with this look? 
Why aren't you broke up? Not a, not a breakup, just a break. Not even barely a break, just kind of a pause. Kevin, so, how are your parents? I told you. I, I didn't know they were getting a divorce. They seemed so happy. Why is Emily with your client? I just wish I could do this day over again. Good morning, sunshine. Charlie. I got you. This is probably cold in hell, though. Oh, my gosh, you guys. Hey, are you feeling OK? Yeah, I'm just having some serious deja vu. Oh, oh I'm so sorry. Well, oh, that's not deja vu. That's just life in this office. We've done this before. You've been acting really strange all day. Did something happen? Multiple times. How long has this been going on for? A while now. I can tell you one thing, you're gonna relive these drinks tomorrow morning. I wish I could believe that. <laughs> if the universe is giving me a chance to relive the same day over and over, maybe it's just giving me a chance to get Kevin back. Well, he's a box of rocks. You're the most amazing woman I've ever met. You're passionate, you're creative, and that's why I'm... That's what I love about you. You like Amber. Good news about you and Charlie, huh? There is no me and Charlie. Really? I mean, he's great, but I would never really date Charlie. Why? Because... What's going on? Look, I'll make it right tomorrow. I mean, you keep talking as if tomorrow's all that matters. I just need one more day. Do me a favor. Tomorrow, if this all happens again, get me out of there. None of this is right. It's tomorrow. Look, Charlie, you were right. I've been looking ahead when... I should have been looking at what was right in front of me. It's tough working random jobs and living alone. You're not alone. You have Brutus. Brutus is a fish. You're going to need to start paying rent, little buddy. Why don't you clock out, get some rest before your night shift? You're late. Sorry, Birdie. Make sure you do your patrols. You got it. Why is this in here? Right, I was actually, I was just And leaving. not up on the wall with the others. Good work, everybody. You heard the man, let's get working on that. Excuse me. Hey. Valerie Stegen, right? Mikey said he made you an offer. But I thought you went to Wolf and Waldron. That's a good idea, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. Oh, no, 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 not with that idea, you're not. Oh. How nice, you came in to save the day for us. Wait, I think you're mistaken. Mis yes! Mistaken, I'll just need you to stop by my desk this afternoon to fill out some paperwork. <laughs> Why, there's... There's been a mix-up. Is it the bonus? What bonus? The sales bonus. You took the job? Yes. When exactly did you lose your mind? At the end of the week, they're pitching Empress Resorts. And then that's it. Bada boom, bada bing, I'm out of there. And it's enough money for me to get caught up on my mortgage. I'll have to dodge Birdie's daily patrol, but... And everyone else while you're in uniform. No one else even knows I exist there. Oh. Woo! <laughs> Is everything okay? Why do you ask? Because you're standing on my foot. This new girl, Val, I'm telling you, man, she's a genius. For the first time, it feels like I might actually be really good at this. How about I walk you out? Someone is waiting for me. You have a someone. Not like a someone, someone. Just like a someone. But do you have? No, uh, oh. no someone. Good. I don't mean good. No, I, I just get mean, it. you know, good. Good. The uh, marketing awards gala is this evening, and I was wondering if you'd like to go. It's a date. You ready? Just waiting on Val. These uh, awards are for the work we did last year, and. She wasn't here. I know. She's coming as my date. Oh. You look beautiful. That's, uh, that's very sweet. Do you know this woman? Yeah, that's my right-hand lady at the security desk. When does she work next? Valerie? Greg, it's not what you think, OK? Don't. I'm sure he'll calm down. Not calming down. He lied to me about everything. Everything? Everything. Her name, her job, her name. That's two things. Empress Resorts offers its guests an unforgettable experience. The only thing missing is you and the people that you love. Because without you, nothing else matters. Mommy used to come here all the time. Oh. Preston, one, one thing, okay? There you go. Thank you. Yeah, have a great day. Oh. Oh. Sorry. It's okay. Here you go. No, it's okay. Hey, um, my name's Wit, by the way. Oh, Jamie. <laughs> Mother of monster. And beauty queen. So what brings you into town? I grew up here. Well, welcome back. 
Where are you from? San Francisco. I'm getting my law degree at Berkeley. I took a few years off, traveled around. International man. Where were you before you were here? Albuquerque. What brought you there? My husband. But for the record, we are separated. It was him, wasn't it? I have to tell you something. I wasn't traveling for pleasure all those years. I was in the CIA. Rick, what are you doing here? Where have you been? I've been calling you. I've left you a million messages. I'm sorry for everything. I did not sleep with my assistant. Rick, you are lying. So what's going on with your ex? He claims he didn't cheat. What's his name? Richard Thompson. Don't mind if I do a little checking well? Richard Thompson. I've been doing some research, and I found some really disturbing information about your ex. He's going to try and take your son. He's going to go for full custody? No, Jamie. He's going to try and kidnap Preston. OK, wait. wait where are you getting this I information? I have my sources. I, I can't tell you anymore, but they're reliable. Listen, I promise, Jamie, I'm not going to let anything happen to Preston, OK? You can't keep my son away from me. Did you think I wasn't going to find out, Rick, about your plan? What? What were you going to do? Take him by force? What are you talking about? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jamie, Jamie, calm down, OK? Yes. Rick just wanted to see his son. Jamie, I have some bad news. Auntie Loretta died yesterday. They're having the memorial at our house. You sure you're ready for this? Yeah, yeah, I want to support you. Yeah. So I brought him. Who? The guy. Him? Yeah. Yes. Oh my god, little witty. Hey, Casey. You guys haven't seen each other since you were kids. It's crazy seeing Wit today. I heard he's in law school. Is that what he told you? Wasn't he traveling this last year? Wit doesn't even have a passport. <laughs> Always knew he was different. I just didn't know back then there was a name for it. Paranoid schizophrenia. What do I do? You end it. Yeah, but no, you don't understand. He knows all this stuff. Wit is sick. Jamie, Wit. Jamie. You need my protection. This is over, OK? I'm sorry. You're coming. I'm sorry, it's over. Coming. Jamie, Jamie, don't do this. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie! What the hell is going on here? Oh! 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 Wait! Wait! Come on, Jamie! Stay away from me! No, no, no! We can leave! We can go away from here! What do you say? I say... In the dark, I feel you One more breath, everything could change It's over! It's not over until I say it's over! As some of you may know, this is my first show in a few years. It's him. <laughs> what are you doing here, Royal? You were nothing before we met. Back off, dude! Holy shit. I moved on. Hi, sweetness. I really don't see the resemblance. You registered every song I ever wrote in her name. She is a spitting image of me. This here is justice. Oh! Oh, <laughs> you recreated me on your body. You need some serious therapy. Destined to be two people with vision living amongst the blind? This is not our destiny, Cricket. What? Whoa, what is this? We're looking for Home Renovation TV's next dynamic duo. It's Demo Day! Day. <laughs> Cricket. You know what all this is, right? You need 
know what we have to do. Mm -hmm. Hey, uh, can we be a bit more artful with it? Copy. Now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> to destiny. Do you realize what you did? You know I'm gonna have to kill you, right? <laughs> you steal half a million dollars from my stash house, and you made it into paradise. That's how you're gonna pay me back the money that you stole from me. You're gonna renovate my house! You have a very nice place here. My designers are your designers. <sighs> Not yes, I get it. You don't know everything about me. The Avengers weren't my first family. At some point, we all have to choose between what the world wants you to be and who you are. What do we got? Some kind of fire? We got units headed out there now. I don't know why he came all the way up here. He won't survive. There are people out there. People worth saving. My dad believed in you. I'm not gonna make the same mistake. You know what happens to you if you go through with this. I have everything I need to have you court-martialed and dishonorably discharged. The end is inevitable, Maverick. What are you gonna do? Here they go! Look at the air! Look at the air! Anyone! to you before, right? Hi, here I am. <laughs> There's something you need to know. Yeah, this is the guest room. Holly and I, we fooled around. You had sex with your college roommate? It was a one-time thing. That happened five or six times. Wow. Who could it be? Don't look at me. You have a threesome opportunity in your very near future. It's <laughs> <laughs> great. I can't stop thinking about it. Well, make it happen. If she gets our way, Things get out of control. Maybe getting a little out of control would be good for us. Okay. Yes! Oh, yes. Yeah. One, two, three, turn around. You're still the best friend I have had. Turn around. Do you prefer having sex with her or having sex with me? With, with you. Took too long to answer. Just turn around. It's not about Holly. This is about us. No would like us to have a threesome. I'm totally into it. How do you feel? On a scale of one to ten, how much do you want to? This is a bizarre conversation. Ten. Ten out of ten. Close the gates! Six of our northern cities have fallen in a coordinated attack. Their leader fights alongside a witch. <laughs> Crush these murderers. Your Majesty. Every family must contribute one man to fight. You're a war hero. You've already made many great sacrifices. My father cannot fight. So I will take his place. The northern invaders will kill her. If I expose her, our own people will kill her. When we take the Imperial City, 
I will take revenge for my father. What is your name, soldier? Hua Jun, Commander, son of Hua Zhou. You will now take the oath of the warrior. Loyal. Brave. True. Die pretending to be something you are not. Yet here I stand, proof that there is a place for people like us. A girl threatens all plans. A warrior.